Hi, I'm Tim Hong, certified sommelier with Total Wine & More, here to talk about the basics of pairing food and wine. Whether you're enjoying a glass with dinner or serving wine at a dinner party, following some basic guidelines will help enhance and maximize the enjoyment of both the food and the wine. Number one, start with a regional pairing. If possible, match the food with the wine from the same area. Think pasta with red sauce and a Sangiovese there's wisdom in following the long-standing traditions of what people drank with their food. Number two, pair acidity with acidity. Wines that are lower in acids, such as a warm climate Chardonnay, will taste flat when paired with acidic foods. A high acid wine, such as a New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc, will pair well with a high acid dish, such as a fresh garden salad. Number three, pair salty with sweet. This combination of flavors is already common in many foods such as chocolate covered pretzels or peanut butter cups. Try pairing a salty blue cheese with a port or sauterne. Number four, pair fat with tannins. Steak and Cabernet Sauvignon is considered a classic pairing because the proteins and fat in the meat soften the tannins in the wine, making this combination harmonious. Number five, pair fat with acidity. For the same reason you would squeeze some lemon juice onto smoked salmon, a high acid wine can cut through the fat of a dish. Next time you make deviled eggs, try it with a glass of champagne. Number six, pair sweet foods with sweeter wines. When pairing wine with dessert, choose one that is sweeter than the dessert. If the dessert is sweeter than the wine, the wine will feel dull. Try an angel food cake with a Moscato de Asti. Though this may not be an exact science, following these suggestions will help you find the right wine for your meal. Soon you'll be pairing food and wine like a sommelier. Cheers.